Hello everyone. I hope you all are doing very well. The following question was asked in GATE CS 2024 and the question was as follows. Consider a TCP connection operating at a point of time with the congestion window size 12 MSS maximum segment size that is and when a timeout occurred due to packet loss assuming that all the segment transmitted in next two RTTs are acknowledged correctly. The congestion window size in MSS during the third rtt will be so basically when the first mss sand so in first rtt uh, got the acknowledgement thereafter two mss will be sent then uh, next uh, data packet will be there and uh, in the second rtt we are going to get the acknowledgement and uh, here it would be fourth mss and here if we are going to send then it would be third RTT fine. Now you know that the congestion window size here is congestion window size here is of 12 MSS. So threshold will be occurred on CW and the congestion window size divided by 2 that is 6 MSS. So here you can just say that uh, uh, here somewhere because 1 MSS, 2 MSS and then 4 MSS will be passed here. So here something 6 MSS will be here. The meaning is that the meaning is that uh, the TCP congestion control enters into slow start phase whenever the congestion window size is lesser than threshold. Right. So the concept is that congestion window size will increase by one after each segment acknowledged and in slow start phase congestion window size get double at every step of RTT. So during which step of RTT? During fourth. During fourth MSS we can say four is the correct answer for this. During third RTT the MSS size uh, the congestion window size in MSS will be 4 because every time is doubled 1 to 2, 2 to 4. Here it would be 6. Doubled. 4 is the correct answer for this gate question. I hope solution is clear, right? Please do subscribe the channel for more such solutions.